What's up guys, Sebastian here from Silicon Valley High School for Money Math. Today, we're gonna to discuss the similarities and differences between credit and debit cards. Both debit and credit cards are electronic methods of payment, but the difference is where the money is deducted from. With a debit card, money is withdrawn directly from your personal bank account. A simple concept. But with a credit card, the money you spend is basically deducted from a credit card company's bank. You have a credit limit with the credit card company and can spend up to that amount before you incur any fees or over the limit charges. And this is the important part. In one month's time, you will need to pay for what you've bought. And if you don't pay, then you will start to be charged interest and you definitely want to avoid that. Now, this may sound somewhat risky, but if you only spend what you can afford, then there really is no risk. In fact, using a credit card is actually safer and more beneficial than using a debit card. For example, if someone steals your credit card and spends your credit, it's actually easier for you to dispute those fraudulent charges. The money stolen has not been taken out of your bank account. It's really being taken from the credit card company's bank account. Don't get me wrong, it would still be a problem, but not as bad as having your money taken from your bank account directly and having to fight to get it back. Credit cards also make it easier to return products that don't work. If the store you bought the product from won't refund your money, you can go back to the credit card company and report a problem with the product. The credit card company deals with the complaint and refunds the purchase. This can save you a lot of grief and it gives you some protection when buying from unknown companies. Some credit cards also offer insurance on your purchases. For example, if your cell phone gets stolen, you can take it up with your credit card company. Actually, my cell phone got stolen and the credit card company replaced it in full. They also offer insurance on rental cars, which can save you money because you won't have to pay for insurance through the rental car company. Unlike debit cards, many credit cards accumulate rewards the more you use them. You could be earning free airline miles or cash back or other rewards for just buying what you normally would. Credit cards can help you build a good credit score. And this is important later in life when you decide to take out a loan on a house or a car. Paying off your credit card bill on time and in full every month is the best way to show future lenders that you are responsible with money. Remember, you absolutely must pay your credit card bill on time, and it is best to pay it off in full. Every penny you spend on your credit card should be paid back each month. This way, you avoid getting swallowed up by debt and nosediving your credit score. There's tons of upside to using a credit card over a debit card for all of your purchases. Just use your credit card like you would a debit card and never spend more than you can afford. Remember to find out what rewards each credit card offers and pick the one that offers you the best incentives. It really pays to read the small print. Until next time, signing off.